and uh, during this return we have also developed our second liners and I think uh, it's time for me to make way for the second liners to take over. We have local uh, leaders who are capable and uh, who are competent and who will be able to uh, perform as well if not better lah than myself. Of course I'm very uh, particular about Shah Alam and I will not surrender the seat to somebody whom I do not believe is capable lah. So the candidate that we have identified is uh, someone who is uh, from the grassroots who has been with uh, in Shah Alam uh, with me even before uh, I won and became the MP in 2008. So it's time for me to say uh, thank you very much to all the uh, voters in Shah Alam. It's been an honour and a privilege for me to be their MP. Uh, but now I, I should surrender it, the seat to uh, the second liners, my uh, lieutenants and all that. And I have to move to uh, another seat uh, if the party so uh, wishes. And it's been rumoured that uh, I will contest in Titiwangsa and that seems to be uh, quite likely. Quite likely. Uh, quite likely, but uh, nothing is sure until you get the, uh, your nomination accepted and you are uh, announced as the candidate. Lah. Okay. Uh, past okay. decision, uh, past Amanah's decision uh, for, yes, is for you to... Yeah. That yeah, is party's yeah, decision. Because the party is very uh, concerned about the request for uh, the current uh, leaders to make way for the younger uh, candidates. Out of the 11 uh, MPs yeah, that we have, uh, uh, minimum, uh, minimum, uh, five or six new faces yeah, uh, from the incumbents. Yeah, so almost half of the seats or the incumbents will make way uh, for new faces and uh, that includes me. Lah, yeah. So we have, uh, even though I'll be um, maybe moving to another seat, but basically, I'm giving uh, the current uh, Shah Alam seat to uh, younger leader. Okay. Okay. Okay.